Mr. Hitler If you think we're on the run We are the boys who will stop your little game We are the boys who will make you think again Cause who do you think you are giving Mr. Hitler If you think old England's done Mr. Brown goes off to town on the A21 But he comes home each evening and he's ready with his gun So who do you think you are giving Mr. Hitler Yes. Yes, I realize that, sir. But I can't ask my men to do a thing like that. I mean, they're, they're frontline fighting troops. They're fighting fit, yes. Can't wait to have a go, Jerry. Uh, just a moment. Wilson, Wilson, do you mind not rustling that paper so much when I'm on the telephone? Oh, so sorry, sir. <laughs> well, I mean, uh, sorry about that, sir. Uh, yes, well, certainly I'll ask them, but I warn you, they're not going to like it. Very well. Everything all right, sir? No, everything is not all right. We're going to be taken off active duty for the next two weekends. Oh, good egg. That means we're going to have a little free time for ourselves. No, no. No time off. We're going to be guarding a prisoner of war camp. Apparently the regular guards have had no leave for months and we're going to relieve, relieve them for the next two weekends. Oh, I see. That means that at last we're going to come face to face with some real Nazis. They're not Nazis, Wilson. They're Italians. <laughs> The point is, if Hitler kicks off over the next two weekends, we shan't be here to stop him. <laughs> we shall be playing nursemaid to a lot of comic opera soldiers. Give me land, lots of land, under starry skies above. No Soon, halt! Left, turn! Stand at ease. Very easy. Uh, pay attention, men. Prisoner of war camp is just around the corner. There are 60 Italian prisoners of war in there, and it goes without saying that they'll be a pretty sloppy bunch. And when we march through those gates, I want them to see what really smart British soldiers look like. You all got that? Yes, right. Now, don't forget, chests out, tins in, marching smartly to attention. Squad, in, and... This is the place, Wilson. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I suppose it's quite uh, possible. You better fall the men out. Right, sir, right, sir. Would you, uh, uh, would you mind falling out, please? <laughs> <laughs> it's absurd. Have you ever heard of a prisoner of war camp without a guard? Nobody up there. Is there? Well, not unless he's kneeling down. Watch it, Wilson. Well, try ringing the front doorbell, sir. Oh, don't talk about nonsense. <laughs> POW camps don't have doorbells. Well, hit that thing, that tin thing. See if anybody hears it. Ah, that's good thinking. Mm. <laughs> Anyone there? Is anybody there? I say! I don't like the look of this, Mr. Mannering. It's just like Bow Jest. When the relief column got to the fort in the desert. And they looked up at the walls, and they're all lined with legionnaires. They're all dead. Then the captain shouted out, Anybody there, just like you did. Next minute, he was flat on his face in the sand with a bullet in his brain. Stupid boy. <laughs> that wasn't bow jest, that was bow legs. <laughs> Look, sir, there's somebody coming out of that hut. Hey, you! He's ignoring us. Hey! Hey! You! Yes! You! Come here. Now, what's going on here? Uh, it's 
This all looks very fishy to me. Who is in charge here? Yeah. Who is in charge? Anybody here speak Italian? I do a little, sir. Che jerry da mamina se la la she raised scalda. What did you say to him, Godfrey? Your tiny hand is frozen. <laughs> Why did you say that? It's all the Italian I know, sir. I'm very keen on opera. This is ridiculous. Open! 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 Ah! Uh, see! Uh, see! I'm going to get to the bottom of this, Jason. Make sure that man doesn't escape. Buongiorno. Who on earth are you? Io. Mi chiamo Franco Bruno Telomonti Verdi. Oh, never mind all that stuff. <laughs> Don't you know that you should stand on your feet when an officer comes into the room? Ma, perché? Eh, you are only a capitano. You should stand up for me because I am a generale. General? Si, generale Franco Bruno Telomonti Verdi. Yeah, no, no, don't, don't start all that stuff up again. Okay, where are the guards who are supposed to be in charge of this camp? Uh, they go. Go? Yes, for a little holiday. Si, the Polish capitanos uh, left for you un, un piccolo biglietto, ecco. See what it says. All right, all right. <clears throat> uh, forgive, please. We, we go, we catch the 1.30 train to London. Otherwise, we miss our end week leave. It's all nice, isn't it? End week leave. You'll get on with it. <laughs> well, don't worry, the Italian prisoners, they, they're quite tame and they work on the farms in the week. See you Sunday night at 20 hundred hours. Uh, <sighs> that's uh, eight o'clock. Yes, 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 I know what time. <laughs> Who signed it? Uh, Captain Shodsky, the Free Polish Forces, sir. I've never heard anything like this in my life. Still, I suppose if you set one lot of foreigners to look after another lot of foreigners, this is the sort of thing that happens. That's quite, sir. Yes. It's outrageous. Mm. I'm going to report this, this Captain Shodsky to GHQ. We've got a telephone. Telephone. Ah, see, si, telephone. is in the guard room. But non vi preoccupare, Capitano. Uh, everything is been... I have looked after everything very good until you have arrived. That's not the point at all. You're a prisoner of war. Don't you understand? We're enemies. No, no, it's not true. Siamo amici. We are friends, Capitano. I have refused to fight against the English. Let me tell you something, Capitano. When I was in Africa, in the deserto, I put up my hands and surrendered. All right. But personal feelings don't enter into this at all. You're a prisoner of war. I represent His Majesty's government. And from now on, I'm going to see that this camp is run properly. Do you understand? And without any familiarity. Oh. Get the men to fall out, Tup. Yes, carry on, Corporal. Hey, Joe! How are you, Joe? <laughs> hey, knock it off, knock it off. You don't know me. No, you are my big friend. What's no. going on here? That's the, uh, that's the continental method, sir. <laughs> Walker, do you know this man? Which one? Yeah, oh, no, no, well, him, no, no, no. I've never seen him before in all my life. No, I have never seen him before in, in his life. <laughs> it all looks very queer to me. <laughs> yes. I don't care. I've had about enough of this foreign nonsense. <laughs> From now on, this place is going to be run according to my lights. You understand? See, according my... to the book. Right. What are these men doing in bed? <laughs> they are in a bed for the, the, the siesta. See it? <laughs> we'll soon see about that. Come on, put your feet. Hey, no, no, get out no, of it. Come on, put your feet. Quick as you can. Sir, please. Get right, Godfrey, and walk in here at once. Oh, no, no. Come on. 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 Come Worked very hard all the week on the farms. Well, I've been working very hard all the week in my bank. You don't catch me spending my leisure hours scrounging in bed, do you? I'm up and about defending my country. See, si, Capito, and they would be up and about defending their country. Or he's too far away. No, Poppycock. <laughs> oh, no, no, hey, Master Jim, no, 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 can you not stop, stop him? For a now, he's here to me. This is a shambles. Why aren't these men wearing prisoner of war uniforms? 
Because, Capitano, they are very proud men. They like to wear their own uniform, all too elegant. Look how much more smart. Hey, right, hey. Present men are correct, sir. <laughs> Thank you, Corporal. There, you see, General. Those are what real soldiers look like. Oh, Capitano, I keep telling you, we don't want to look like a real soldier. We are not enemies. Until I receive orders to the contrary, we are enemies. So you better do something about it. I mean, you're not even trying, are you? Uh, you can at least make some effort. Oh, Capitano, you are a very hard man. I have to be a hard man, General. Otherwise, we'd all be under the Nazi jet boot by now. Fraser, Mike, Godfrey, Walker, go and get the rest of the men out of the rest of the huts. Get them on the parade ground at the double. Right, hey! At the double, quick, march! No, no, grazie. Uh, Capitano, vi piace un pomodoro, eh? Don't be disgusting. Get out of it. Now, <laughs> Corporal, oh, oh. good. Get these men out of here onto the parade ground and count them. With the others, there should be 60 altogether. Very good, sir. Right, come on, then. On the move now. Come on. On the move. Right, right. On the... Oh. It's like that, is it? Right. We'll see about that. Right! Come on now! On the move! Come on now! 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 That's the only language they understand, sir. You see, they don't like it up them, so they do not like it up that's the stuff, Coral. Right, jolly good. Get out. Come on now, boys. Wait. Excellent. Don't you think, Sergeant? Yes, I do, sir. Very good indeed. Yes, sir. Capitano, you are very cruel, man. You don't think I'm enjoying this, do you? <laughs> Corporal! Good. Line them up in threes and start counting them. Very good, sir. Very good, sir. Come on, line up, you lot. Now, come along now. Corporal Jones will soon tell us if any are missing. Yes, it's going to be rather difficult for him, sir. I mean, they all look rather alike to me. No, it's the Chinese that look all alike. <laughs> Like Chinese. Yes, I see. Yes, but, but, but these look alike. See, like, uh, like, uh, like Italian. Yes, you see. Right, right, right. Anyone? Twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, fifteen. Why 15, don't you shut 18. up? I can't get on and do it properly. Can I help it if you're not totally illiterate? Anyway, I've counted them all. They're all there. Sixty. Oh. Well, I can't help that. I've got to start again. <laughs> <laughs> Two, three, four. Corporal. Uh, I've only got as far as four, sir. Yes, well, never mind. Stop counting. Give him some drill. Very good, sir. Right, sir. Get some drill, sir. Come on, all right. Get lined up there. Right. Now's right. your chance to see a really first-class British NCO in action. This <laughs> 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 will lick some shape into your chaps. Get up now. Squad! A tick! Nut! Quick! Nut! Quick! Much! Quick! Go! Oh. So darkly a bantney! Hey! Right! Hey! Right! What's the Italian for all? <laughs> oh, never mind, it's too late now. Dining <laughs> at the Ritz and a nightingale sang with God. Never had anything so stupid in all my life. Squeezing us all in here like this. Captain Manwin's orders, isn't it? He told me we've got to stay here so he can lay his hands upon me in signs of trouble. Anyway, the rest of the platoon there patrolling the wire. Right, I've had enough of this. I'm going down below. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We've got to stay here until we're relieved. Well, I've got to be relieved now. I can't wait. <laughs> well, all right then, but don't be long. Come on, move round. Uh, excuse me, Mr Jones. Yeah? Uh, do you think I could be excused as well? Oh, all right, all right. Help me down the stairs, somebody. Come well, on, I'll move, give you an angle. Move round, all right. Come on, sir. Oh, yeah, I've been looking for you everywhere. Where you been? Listen, I've got to get your blokes out tonight, as arranged, all right? No, Joe, he's not all right. It's too dangerous. And this Capitano, Mannering, is watching all the time, non-simpatico. Yeah, don't worry about him. We'll get him out through the escape tunnel. 
No, 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 Joe, it's too dangerous. I get shot. Never mind about you, mate. What about me? If I don't fulfil my orders, it's the end of me. Uh, see, possibly you're right, John. Without you, our cause would be lost. Yeah, well, just you remember that, mate. Now, listen, see. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Uh, uh, Look, I'm, after I'm off duty, I'm going to go into Wilmington on the bike, pick up the van, bring it back. I'll park it in the road outside the wire. Now, you get your blokes out through the escape tunnel, into the van and away. I don't like it. Look, all you've got to worry about is getting those radio sets working by first thing tomorrow morning, all right? Sweet. Right, T.T. Uh, Finn. Uh, come here, T.T. Hey. Ciao. Oh, si, sí. ciao. Eh, I don't like it. Oh, no. oh dear, oh, dear. Oh, dear. What time is it, Wilson? Five to twelve, sir. Twenty-three fifty-five, eh? <laughs> well, we've been up here for over two hours, sir. Nothing's happened. You know, I don't think he's going to try tonight, after all. Believe me, Wilson, I know the criminal mind. <laughs> Walker will reveal himself sooner or later. Mm. Godfrey? Yes. You were sure that it was tonight he was going to help the prisoners escape? Oh, yes, Mr. Marin. He said he had to fulfill his orders, get them out through the tunnel and away in the van, and they had to get the radios working by morning. You know, I still find it hard to believe that Walker's a fifth columnist. Oh, hmm? I can believe it. I can't have always said that Spev fella was no good. No doubt about it. No doubt at all. He'd been a friend of mine for years, Joe has. And I think all this time... I've been harboring a viper between my bosoms. <laughs> I should have suspected something as soon as I saw that general fling his arms around his neck. A true blue Britisher would have repelled him instantly. <laughs> if only we knew where that escape tunnel was, you see. Permission to speak, sir. Yes. I've got an idea, sir. Yeah. Why don't I dress myself up as an Italian prisoner of war, sir, and I can mingle among them? And then when they go down in their tunnel, I can go down alongside with them. And then, all of a sudden, at a certain point, I can stick my bane up through the ground. <laughs> and then you can come walking nonchalantly along, perhaps, and you'll espy it. And therefore, you'll know the whereabouts of where the tunnel is. <laughs> Didn't you hear what I said, sir? Yeah. <laughs> Look, sir, what, what's that there? Uh... That's him. Let's walk. Yeah. Get down in case he sees right. right. Now we go down and we'll follow him. Right, Wilson. When I give the word, we rush in and catch him red-handed. All right. Now stand by. Now. Right, Walker, the game's up. Come on. Pick up. Nobody here, Wilson. Yeah. We must have gone down through the tunnel. We'd better find it. It's under these floorboards somewhere. All right. I beg your pardon, sir. Sorry. <laughs> there it is. Good heavens, Pike. How on earth did you know it was there? Well, we saw it in that film, uh, Escape from Stalag 9, didn't we, Uncle Arthur? Yes, that's right, Frank. We did. It wasn't really one of my favourites, you know. There was that, uh, what was his name? That uh, Conrad, that German actor. <laughs> all the women were absolutely potty. Oh, no, never mind all that stuff. <laughs> Wilson. Yes, sir. Yes. Now, you take Godfrey and Fraser yes, and go and guard the other end of the top. Right, sir. Right. If it comes in a, in a straight line, along with this one, yes. then it should come up about 100 yards left of the main gate. Oh, right? yes. Right. Okay. Right. right. Come on, then. Right. Now, Godfrey, be very, very careful. Don't All right. Out there, right. The rest of you come with me. Come on. Right. Follow right. me. Right. What are you doing? What are you doing? Help me down. What are you doing? Hurry up. We haven't got all night. I'll soon have your way. What are you talking about? Don't be bombing. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. No. No. I'm not going to shoot. Shooting's too good for you. We're going to string you up on the hanging tree 
to the hung and three. Walker. Walker. Now, really, this is, isn't it? I, I mean, it really is too bad. Yeah, what's the matter with you? You all gone balmy or something? Don't try and regular out of it, you, you worm! Oh, Mr. Walker, why ever did you do it? I do what? It's no use, Walker. We know that you're trying to help these prisoners to escape. Escape? Mm. What, are you, what are you talking about? I'm only putting them on the night shift. The night shift? Yeah. Well, I'm down in one of my sheds. I mean, I'll pick them up at night and I'll take them back early in the morning. They're helping me assemble radio parts. Well, how long has this been going on? Well, it's been going on for months. Well, I mean, you know, it's hard to get labour these days. I mean, I'm going to go broke if I don't fulfil the orders. Oh, oh, those orders? Well, I'd better go tell Captain Mannering. I think he's still in that tunnel. Push harder, Jones. <laughs> sure, I am pushing. Oh. I am pushing. Put your back into it, Pikey. I can't. I'm in the wrong position. <laughs> What's that? Me head, I can only use that. <laughs> Who's that? Oh. It's me, sir. Oh, it's you, Wilson. Yeah. Did you catch Walker? Uh, uh, yeah, oh, yes, yes. But he, he thought of his columnist, sir. He was just taking the prisoners of war out, you know, to, to, to make radio sets. To what? Yes, radio sets. <laughs> I'll have him court martial for this. Look here. Hmm? Well, it's now stuck. Right, sir. Lend a hand, will you? Right, sir. Right. All right. I've got you, sir. Right. Now, when I say pull, mm. pull. Right. Pull! Oh, Jones! Jones, what are you doing? I'm pulling, sir. You said pull, didn't you? You don't pull. You push. Oh, right. Right, push. Oh. <laughs> Wilson! Yes? You don't push. Oh. You pull. I'm sorry. You right. pull and Jones pushes. Do you understand? Yes, I do, sir. Yes, I'm sorry, sir. Yes. All right. Uh, push. Right. Push. Pull. Uh. Push. Uh. Pull. Uh. No, 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 look, rest, 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 rest. I've rest. got an idea, sir. Why don't we do it like as if we're unblocking a drain? <laughs> yes, sir, would you, uh, would you like us to do that? Do anything you like, but get on with it. Uh, right, now, listen, you men. Now, listen, like Mr. Manrin, he's the obstruction. And we're going to work him up and down until he becomes unblocked, right? Right, right. Right, Pike, you ready? Yeah. Mr. Wilson, you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Right. Ready, yes. Forward! Backwards! Forward! Backwards! Forward! Backwards! Stop! Forward. Stop! Forward. Stop! Forward. Stop! Stop! Forward. 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 Stop! He had so much honey, you see, he got a bit fat and he got stuck in a hole and they had to wait a week for him to get a little bit thinner so that he could free himself. Do you understand? <laughs> Very amusing, Wilson. <laughs> now get on with it. Right, all right. Permission to do something to you, sir? Yes, what is it? Yes! Ah! I'm sorry, sir, but sometimes you have to be cruel to be kind. <laughs> There we are, sir. All right, sir. You all right now? Take your hands off me, Walker. I'll deal with you later. Just a minute, sir. There's a car drawing up at the gates. Halt! Who goes there? Captain Bailey from GHQ. You hear that, sir? It's, it's Captain Bailey. What on earth does he want? Well, perhaps he came to call upon you about the call you made on GHQ earlier on. Good Lord, I've forgotten all about that. Hmm? Right, Wilson. Yeah. Get the prisoners out of that van, right. back through the tunnel and into the hut. Right. Now, I'll keep Captain Bailey away from the hut as, uh, as, as long as possible. Right. Yeah, right. Uh, Fraser? Yes, sir. Jones and Pike, you come with me. Sir. Sir. Look, open the gate. I want to speak to Captain Mallory. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Now, look here, Mallory. What's all this about Captain Shotsky clearing off and leaving no one on guard? Oh, uh, a storm in a teacup, sir. I've sorted it all out. I see. And have you checked all the prisoners? Yes, I counted them. There were exactly 60. As and I counted 62. Well, not 62, 60 also. I, I, and I counted them as well, sir. 60. I wanted to count them. You'll be quiet, Pike. <laughs> right. Now I'm going to count them. Come on. Well, I, I shouldn't go in that hut, sir. Why not? Well, sir, it's not, it's not a very nice hut, sir. It's not a... Why did not you go in one of these more? Highly pleasant huts, sir. <laughs> but I don't want to go into one of those huts. Come on, Mary. Oh, right, sir. Well, the place is empty. Where is everybody? 
Yes, well, I told you sir, they're in other huts, you see, sir. They're, they're, they're in more highly pleasant huts, sir. This isn't a very nice hut, you see, sir. Well, what's the matter with it? Well, it's, you know, it's, it's got the minge, you know, sir. And <laughs> the snow, uh, uh, the roof leaks, the snow comes through, sir. What? In July? Well, if it was December, it had probably come through, you know. <laughs> Oh, do forgive me sitting down in the presence of officers, but, but I'm not as young as I was, you know, sir. I quite understand. Yes, yes, quite. Oh, Mr. Bailey! Nice to have Mr. Bailey here, isn't it, Mr. Manorin? Very nice to have him here. And Mr. Bailey has got two military policemen with him. <laughs> Why are you shouting? Well, I, I have to do a lot of that, you see. It keeps the men on their toes. I'm used to doing that, you see, sir. I see. Yes, sir. Well, I want you to go outside, get hold of all the POWs, line them up and send them through. I want to count them. Yes. Oh, right. Captain Manning, you'd look rather tired. Why, why don't you sit oh. down on the... <laughs> sit down there. Sir. Thank sit you. Sit down there. That's right, sir. Thank you very much. That's right, sir. Now, now I'm going to bring the prisoners through. All right. And I'm going to bring them right through here, you see, sir. All right. Yes, sir. All right. Bring them through here, sir. And there's going to be exactly 60 of them, sir. All right. Come on, Pike, come on, Fraser. Oh, no. <laughs> now, that, that was a right daft thing to say. How can we send 60 prisoners through 20 and missing? Well, didn't you ever go to the pantomime when he was a kid? I get you Ali Baba and the 40 Thieves. Shh. What yeah. are you talking about? Well, uh, you know, Ali Baba and the 40 Thieves, they sent the prisoners round and round again and again. It'll never work. Yes, It'll never work, I tell you. Well, shut up and get them lined up. Come on, let's work. work. It's no good, Sergeant. I can't shift it. Yeah, let's have a bit of a rest and then we'll try again later. I'm tired out. I want to get this over with, Mannering, and get back to bed. I do not like being called out in the middle of the night. If it hadn't been for you, we wouldn't have been in this position in the first place. Don't worry about it. We'll try hmm? it again later, won't we? I mean, right. when we feel more fresh. You're ever fag. Right. Thank you. It won't be long now, now, sir. Yeah. Oh, no, yeah. Whoa! No smoking, if you don't mind, sir. Hmm. No smoking, if you don't mind, sir. What are you talking about? I'm not smoking. No, sir, but if you were smoking, we'd sooner you didn't. <laughs> just, um, please don't shout, Corporal. Oh, I'm sorry, sir, I'm sorry. Excuse me, sir. Uh, prisoners are ready for counting. Oh, thank God for that. Send them through. <laughs> right. right, send them through, Pucky. Send the prisoners through. There it comes, sir. Right. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. Twenty. There we are, sir. Twenty prisoners through there, sir. Correct. Yes. Send the next lot through. Right. Right. Pikey. Pikey. You send the next two through, boy. Right. Chop, chop. Come on. Chop, chop. 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 All oh, right, there's only 20 more now, mind you, Pike. Hey, no, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> no Mallory, all these Italians seem to me to be alike. I know. Same with the Chinese. <laughs> there we are, sir. There's 60, sir. 60 prisoners. Correct. Right? Well, they're all accounted for. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 61. <laughs> 63, 64, 65, 